you may have seen many variation formulas in geometry. Some, like the formula for the perimeter of a square, are simple direct variations. Others, like the volume of a cone, relate three or more variables. When one quantity varies with respect to two or more quantities, you have a combined variation. When one quantity varies directly with two or more quantities, you have a joint variation. The volume of a cone varies jointly with the area of the base and the height of the cone. Capital V equals K times capital B times H, or volume equals K, the constant of variation, times the base, the area of the base, capital B, times the height of the cone. Take note, key concept, combined variations. On the left, we'll see the combined variation in words, and on the right, it's equation form. First, z varies jointly with x and y. It's equation form, z equals kxy. Take note, z varies directly with both x and y. As x, y, or the product of x times y increases, z increases. Also note, k is the constant of variation and not a variable. Next, z varies jointly with x and y and inversely with w. Its equation form, z equals kxy over w. So note, as x, y, or the product x times y increases, z increases, and as w increases, z decreases. Note once more, k is the constant of variation and not a variable. Finally, z varies directly with x and inversely with the product wy. Its equation form, z equals kx over wy. So in this case, as x increases, z increases, and as w or y or the product w times y increases, z decreases. Once more, it should be noted that k is the constant of variation, not a variable. Problem four, using combined variation. This one's multiple choice. The number of bags of grass seed n needed to reseed a yard varies directly with the area a to be seeded and inversely with the weight w of a bag of seed. If it takes two three-pound bags to seed an area of 3,600 square feet, how many three-pound bags will seed 9,000 square feet? Is it A, three bags, B, four bags, C, five bags, or D, six bags? Well, since we know that N varies directly with A and inversely with W, we'll write our formula, N equals the constant of variation K times A over w. We'll substitute the given values for n, for a, and for w, and our formula becomes 2 equals 3600k over 3. Then we'll work to solve for k. We'll multiply each side by 3, and then divide each side by 3600, and find that k equals 6 over 3600, which simplifies to 1 over 600. Knowing our constant of variation k, we can now write that the combined variation equation is n equals a over 600 times w. We'll use that combined variation equation, n equals a over 600 w, and we'll substitute for a and for w, a being 9,000 and w, 3. We'll simplify this and find that it equals 5. And so we state our final answer. You need five three pound bags to seed 9,000 square feet. The correct choice is C. Your turn. The number of bags of mulch you need to cover a planting area varies jointly with the area to be mulched A in square feet and depth of the mulch D in feet. If you need 10 bags to mulch 120 square feet to a depth of three inches, how many bags do you need to mulch 200 square feet to a depth of 4 inches?